Okay, happy Sabbath, children. It's good to see you. You may come up to the front. Yeah, okay, because I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? So be ready to answer. Today, um, uh, let's see, the memory, the verse is, comes from Matthew 7, 7, and it says, Ask, and it will be given to you. And if you know it, you can repeat it. Seek, and you will find... Knock, and the door will be open to you. Matthew 7, 7. So I have some things, or Virginia has some things in this little bag that serve the same purpose. Okay, I'm going to give you some clues. Let's see if you guys can guess what's in the bag. But they are different. Do you, do you need some clues? Yeah, okay. So sometimes they are open, and sometimes they are not. You need more clues? Banana? <laughs> okay, but if you already knew that. <laughs> sometimes, okay, let's see. You need, uh, let's see, sometimes you need a key, but sometimes you need to know uh, numbers. A door? Sometimes they, they, you can keep it, keep things in, and sometimes you can keep things out. Yes, it's a lock. Very good. So here are, um, here's a kind of lock that we have. And this is, um, this is a kind of lock that needs a key, right? But do you think any kind of key can open it? Or does it need a specific key? Yes, it does need a specific key. And have you ever seen a combination lock? What is a combination lock? Yes. You have to put a password or, or the combination, the, key, the numbers, the correct numbers, right, to open it. So you have to turn it to the right and to the left and to the right again. But if you put the wrong numbers, you will not be able to open it, right? So the, uh, let's see, so Virginia has some keys here, and she's going to try to open this lock. And if you don't use the correct key, the lock will still be locked let's see nope that one doesn't fit let's see how about if we use the house key you think that'll work no so nope that one doesn't work so as you grow older you will need many different keys to do your parents have a lot of different keys in their keychain yeah, yeah what, what what do they use their keys for yeah what kinds of things yeah, house, one for the house, one for the car, one for the gate, very good, one for the church, very good. There's so many different kinds of keys, and they're all different, right? So there is another key that everyone needs, and this key is spoken about in the Bible. Can, I, can anybody guess what it is? And it opens your connection with Jesus. What's the key that opens our connection with Jesus? Faith. Very good. Yes, we do need to have faith. We need to believe in Jesus, right? Otherwise, then, then we, we can't get anything done, right? So can you guess? Uh, let's see. So it's prayer. If we pray to Jesus every day, he will open the right doors so that we will do what he knows is best for us, right? So if we pray, he's going to open the doors. So, so prayer is the key to Jesus, right? This is how we communicate with him. So keeping in touch with him every day will keep us happy no matter what happens because we know we can trust him. We can help, he can help us choose good friends Good things to read, good games to play, good things to watch, good things to eat. All the choices we make every day. Let's see if this key opens this lock. Oh, look at that. And now you, it opened, the key, the, the key opened. That's a perfect key to open that lock. But the perfect key... For, for us to have a connection with Jesus is the P word. Say it. Prayer. Prayer. Very good. Prayer is the, the right key, the perfect key to keep us 
uh, connected to Jesus. So you will learn that Jesus can, can and will help you in everything you do all day long because he is your friend. So raise your hand if you want Jesus to protect you by, by teaching you to use the key to his prayer lock of safety. Yes, amen. So let's, let's pray and let's get connected to Jesus. Be careful. All right, boys and girls, close your eyes. Let's, let's have a little word of prayer. Heavenly Father, we thank you, Lord, for giving us the key that connects us to you in heaven, Lord, and that is prayer, Lord. Thank you because we can talk to you and you listen to us and you give us the right direction in which to, to uh, walk in our walk with you, Lord. Help us to always remember to pray each day and for everything, give you glory and honor, Lord. Bless these children and and help us all to grow spiritually closer to you. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.